I cannot wait for you guys to see what they have. Uh, we're going to start off with a game called Goon River. Uh, how this works is we're going to come to you for a suggestion in just a second. And each of these improvisers here are going to portray a series of characters, uh, each giving their own unique perspective on your suggestion in a monologue-esque style. Uh, you'll see how it works. Uh, all we need from you guys right now is maybe a location that you find a lot of people gathered at. Russia. Guess it's mall. What was this over here? Russia. <laughs> uh, I like mall. I really like mall. Uh, let's go. Let's go with mall. Uh, everyone enjoy Goon River. I don't want to be Santa Claus anymore. They don't pay me jack. Malls in Russia are so terrible. <laughs> Welcome to Sparrow. What four hours slice of pizza would you like? <laughs> would you like to see a little lotion? <laughs> Molly Mart, Mall Cap. <laughs> Welcome to Jay Grew. Our floors are now clean with toothbrushes. <laughs> uh, I was here for underwear, yeah, underwear. Victoria's <laughs> Secret? Shop. <laughs> <laughs> I can't even wear my beard anymore. Kids are allergic to it. Kids and their allergies nowadays. Am I right? <laughs> if you buy four of these lotions, you get three free and then a coupon to come back <coughs> after the holidays for $10 off a $45 purchase. Then you can also get a bag for $15. <laughs> you can have this slice of pizza on the floor, but you can have it for free. I won't tell anybody if you don't tell them. Bam, bam, come back here. Come back here. I see you. Yep. Nope. Around the corner. I see it. It's worth it because I have a 3% employee discount. <laughs> <laughs> I think I have my gift card at home. I have the credit card. These are very reasonable prices. They're only $699. And if we spend another hundred, we will lose maybe $50. <laughs> I am an officer of the law. I am an officer of the law. <laughs> I am depressed. I am. <laughs> Well, from the people that have more. 
You know, a pirate's life, yippee. <laughs> a pirate's life, yippee. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh, oh, my what? what hurts? What was this? Your what hurts? Your what hurts? Wrong <laughs> brain. Uh, cool, great. Uh, so let's go through these uh, suggestions uh, one more time, starting over here.
uh, movies, uh, reviewing and critiquing them, and then we're gonna be able to see uh, a couple clips from some of those movies, which is awesome for you guys. Um, so, uh, without further ado, this is at movies. Take it away, critics. Maybe uh, do you think we could get a suggestion? You guys want a suggestion? <laughs> Fine. <laughs> <laughs> I tell you, this is insane. Sure, right there. Uh, yes, they're going to be reviewing some of their uh, favorite movies, but guys, uh, they have so many. Uh, we need a suggestion from you guys of uh, what, what, what is a, um, a uh, movie that has never been made yet? I heard Christmas at sea, uh, and I love it. <laughs> Uh, the timely classic, um, Christmas at sea. Uh, yes, hello, I'm Chip Stamper. And I'm Walter Withers, and welcome to Critics' Corner. We'd like to take you through a few of our favorite and not-so-favorite films today. <laughs> <laughs> we start off with a hit summer blockbuster drama about a manic depressant and his talking dog. <laughs> it's real interesting, and you'll see through our favorite film, The Dog, Always gets me. The dog always gets me as well. A little bit choked up also. He's got some very insightful words of wisdom. <laughs> the wisest <laughs> dog since Snoopy. <laughs> you don't agree? You don't? I don't. I, I agree so much I have nothing more to say. <laughs> <laughs> That's my favorite co-host. Alright, go ahead and show us the best scene of the film Christmas at Sea. <laughs> You're smarter than that. Get on the two. Get on two feet. I know it's cute. You know it's all furry, but uh, Arr, part of a manically depressed. Don't you understand? <laughs> <laughs> hey, 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 hey! I got just different. Great. <laughs> Uh, in this one, 
th this is this is about a lizard who's fighting off starvation. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I think it was interesting. An interesting choice. Both characters have gender gender neutral names. So Thomas and Jessica. Yes, and it fits very well. <laughs> it's very well with their translucent personalities and uh, their shape shifting thoughts on. The environment. That Was that a pun against chameleons? I try as well. <laughs> <laughs> so let's 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 see the hungry lizard. <laughs> so hungry, a starving of starvation. <laughs> I gotta eat something. Any bugs? So fight the urge. Like, I know we say too. that, like, no, remember our minds shape shift. As well as our. Colors. And there's nothing that tastes as good as being thin lizards. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I don't think so. 
was tap. Okay, there you go. Get your pointer. 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 Get your